spite of the COVID thing, we are here, united and as one. God is always uh, making the we're giving ways, brighter ways to connect the most awaited part of this event. So we are here gathered to witness in advance and to testify and celebrate the wedding of our Claire Marie and Josh. Claire, be faithful always and Josh, love always my niece, huh? Claire Marie. Thank you. Congratulations. Hi Claire, we are here gathered tonight for your most awaited moment, December 12, 2020. Are you with Josh right now? Ah, tulog pa siya. Okay. Pukawa na. <laughs> yeah, we are here tonight fly with the family of Auntie Bibi and also the family of Uncle Tata. Hi Claire and Joshua. So, we welcome you to the family and congratulations. We wish you nothing but the best and a good start. Thank you. Hi, I'm Claire and Josh. Uh, uh, the moment Ate Claire told us that uh, finally she will be fine. And, uh, uh, we are very happy. We are very happy that finally God answered not only Ate Claire's prayer, but the family's prayer. That you will find someone who she will spend the rest of her life with. So, Te and Josh, we are very happy. Um, may you continually make God the center of your married life. So, before we came here, um, Han Soi whispered to me, he told me that um, to tell you that he wants a playmate very soon. <laughs> Josh and Claire Marie Nini, your daddy and mommy Lilith, and your brother and sister. We are so very, very happy, especially me, that all my prayers to the Almighty God, that this day will come, that you can get a partner, a responsible, a handsome boy, in the name of Josh. Very sorry, Claire and Josh. Your daddy, your mommy, and your brother and sister cannot attend because of the COVID. But because of our love, we are so happy and happy. And thankful to Almighty God. Actually, I'm supposed to be her maid of honor. It just so happened that we are not there. We're not able to go there since um, there is pandemic. And I understand that um, it's hard for you, Ate, because uh, because you really wanted us to be there. I know because you really you really cried, and I was there at the clinic. You know how much I helped just to let Daddy and Mommy go there. But the moment you asked me if. It is still safe that both of them could travel and then, sorry but I said no. Since we cannot risk their health at this moment, why tissue? Ako <laughs> makeup! Anyway, um, you understood the situation. Do not worry because, as you can see, even from afar, we are celebrating your very important day of your life. And we are very happy, I'm very happy for you. 
I know that you're crying also from afar. <laughs> the cake as the symbol of unity, unity, um, commitment, commitment, longevity, longevity and support, support for each other. Each other. Okay. And the center is always the most powerful, the Almighty God. We will also give a slice to each other. Okay. For Daddy. Thank you, me, for the love. And this is also your share for your support for the success of the family. And always be Wish you the best of luck uh, and best wishes. And God bless on your marriage. Hello Claire, Pastor Joss, congratulations. One message, please love each other, talk to each other, and nice. always pray and have faith in God. Congratulations and oh, um, enjoy the, ano, the new chapter of your lives, no? So, yun lang. <laughs> My only share to you, with my experience, you know that I'm 61 years old. You must always pray together. And the center in your life is the most powerful, the Almighty God. Problem will come, but because of the blessing and support of the Almighty God, there must always be a solution of problem. Marriage is not complete or perfect, but because of your prayer and guidance of the Almighty God, your marriage will be successful. Josh, welcome to the family! Josh and Claire, congratulations and best wishes! God bless to come! Yay! I, as a mother, would like to remind you to be Christ-centered. Always have Christ at the middle of your marriage. Always instill communication to both of you. You need to talk, whatever it is. You have to open up things. And always talk whatever um, circumstances that happen to you. Everything will be settled. Now, I would like also to remind you that uh, you are bounded in marriage. It is a sacrificial thing. It's one of the sacraments of matrimony. So it just would mean to say that it would not be all happiness. As the word implies, there is sacrament, so meaning there are sacrifices. But you have to remember that what God has put together, nobody has, has the right to separate it. My message for uh, both of you, um, there's a motto that I am always believing and doing it. Um, a happy wife will have a happy life. So, I um, understand always the woman or your um, partner, your wife. So, understand uh, her weakness and appreciate her strengths. So, um, not only you but also Claire, um, do it, my ate. Please understand also Josh because um, we, husband, uh, we also has uh, weaknesses and strengths. Okay, so always pray together. I love you both. And also remember that time that Josh um, asked your hand for an engagement, the time he proposed to you, I was the first one you called right away and I was really wondering why you called so rush while I was about to go to the CR. <laughs> and then you, you just smiled and then eventually you showed up your hand with a ring on it and then I cried instead na ikaw ang cry but you cried but I cried firsthand and then you cried eventually because I cried too and you know that connection that even we are afar you know that we are sisters by heart and I'm really happy and I feel secured and at peace right now that finally you're able to meet the man of your life the man of your dreams and the man that you prayed for to Josh and Claire Best wishes and congratulations! Cheers! Cheers. Wow! <laughs>
<laughs> to Josh, um, the time that you asked for my sister's hand, I know for sure that you know the consequences. Just always be on her side, be on her, be on her team, and if you are already mad at her, just please communicate so that you guys could settle it right away. Ano sa pagkukas lunga ano? Okay. Patulo. But then I have to I have to ask Bitoy for his techniques. Claire and Josh, always put the Lord in your lives. Always, every conversation, every scenario, allow the Lord to be in the center. So that's that's the most I know great blessing in our lives, in your marriage. So as you go along, as you move forward in your marriage, so I pray. My prayer is that you will grow together, serving the Lord. You will grow together, knowing the Lord deeper. You will encounter and you will read His Word together. And that that is my prayer for for your marriage, guys. That all of your lives, you will just serve the Lord. You will just serve the people around you. So again, thank you and congratulations. So yun. Josh, uh, first and foremost, no words to say. Like, because I know my sister very well in terms of <laughs> choosing a guy. <laughs> okay. I salute you. I'm so happy and overwhelmed because uh, Claire found you. I will really thank the Lord for having you to my sister's life. Happy new beginnings to you, Claire Marie and Joshua. On this day, special day, I place you under God's gracious care. May your love for each other endure. I pray that your family life will bear much fruit for the great, greater glory of God. Congratulations, Claire and Josh. We have to mangkut kita.